Right. Honey, I'm taping. Oh, that's that thing. What up? So listen. Self-reliance number two. Now I feel very sad that I had to go to Lowe's and I had to buy my wood for my shed. It's over there. We're building the shed Lowe's. to replace the pack rat. The pack rat is one more sign of the oppressive man. <laughs> this is what the man has done to us. We want to move to a self-reliant space from our larger, very larger home. And in the process, we had a hell of a lot more stuff. Um, we had to put it in the pack rack. And the thought was that we would transition so quickly to this new piece of land that we would make new homes and put a place with it. It's unrealistic. Give yourself some time in order to adapt to what it means to be self-reliant. That thing is costing me $150 a month. Um, in my very, very serious protest, I stopped paying, and I'm not going to pay him anymore because it's a cost of almost $22,000 a year. This shed will be bigger, better, more awesome, and have multi-purpose and multi-use. And it's costing us about $750, which I'm very ashamed of because if I had a meal, then literally, I swear to you, if we had our meal and we were able to mill the trees that we had in the back, the only thing we would have to brought out here would be the nails. Um, and we are now hog tied because of that. Well, nails, and then we probably would have brought the roofing tar and some uh, metal roofing sheets, but the metal roofing sheets would have cost less than $100. So we could have replaced $2,000 for $100. Um, with some skill, know-how, and some wood. But anyway, we're building that shed. Um, this is the wall. The floor is already going down. We leveled it out with the, um, concrete bricks so you see we had to do some digging and stuff to get a nice level uh, platform and then from there we're going to actually build our shed and you get an update later on if you see the axe over there it's because we had to cut through humongous or old pine roots um, anyway it's fun enough but um, definitely learn, learning uh, super self-reliant work-life balance right now